Oh wow, this person's kind of attractive actually. Oh no! Like uh personality question mark. Am I gonna get canceled for that? Imagine if her father saw this. Probably a gym membership. Kennedy here happens to be giving um, oral pleasures to a statue. I give no fuck, those come easy. Take me out to ice cream and I'll love you forever. And basically, I thought of the pun, the only thing I see creaming is you. Damn! No wonder you want validation because you don't get any in real life, so you have to go to Tinder, isn't that right? Smart, funny, great cuddler, what more could you want? Probably a gym membership. <laughs> oh shit, we got Zoe here, she's 18, she got a little devil thing, she's got a little devil in her, you know what I mean? Alright. www.bible.com <laughs> The average IQ is definitely going a downward slope right now. She says right here, she's a social smoker. No wonder you have cancer. Like, duh. Hannah here says, I hope you like Taylor Swift. Fuck Taylor Swift. Okay, yeah, some of her old songs were pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. If you played some in the car, I would sing along. But fuck you. You look like the before picture for a waist trainer ad. She's got a cute dog. I I can't even roast her. Like that is such a cute dog. Like I, I mean he's ugly, but like you know, like it's a cute dog nonetheless. Wait. No. What the hell, dude? She's giving the dog a vape, bro. Hell no, man. What? Guys, I'm about to start a GoFundMe so I can adopt this dog. She's literally l making her dog vape. I want to report her, but there is no, like, animal abuse option. Joe, come look at this. Dude, look at this. Like, why, like, what do they think they're doing in this? What the fuck? They think this is attractive. That, that makes me want to, like, run. They think they're doing something in that picture. Th they really do, but they're really not. Nope. No. No. Home workout. All. Home workout, more like writing fucking cock. Cheyenne, young age of 19. <laughs> you had so much going for you. She did. She, you know, she had a father at one point. At one point, yes. Yeah. Imagine if her father saw this. Oh. <laughs> Janae here says, I'm just a bad bitch with her nipples and clip pierce. That's it. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, so we got Lindsay here. She's 19. Uh, okay. Pretty normal, normal white girl. Pr pretty, pretty normal white girl. Uh, wait a minute. That's alcohol! And you're 19! How dare you! I would never, ever drink underage. I have to call her out for it. This is completely unacceptable. Excuse me. You are not 21. If you like hot nurses or v-ball players or both, hit me up. Okay, okay. Um... Wow. Julia, you did your friend dirty. No, man. You gotta you gotta stay away from these dyed hair girls, man, for real. Like, literally. Animals are brightly colored. Is the use of warning coloration to inform potential predators that an animal is poisonous, venomous, or otherwise dangerous. But girls are the same way! <laughs> down, 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 down. Oh, oh, down. Like, maybe they're a nice person. But you can't be dressed like that, and looking like that, and expect everyone to be like, Oh my god, slay. Not one, but two pictures in a row, showing off the vines. Also, why the hell does she have a sword? I don't want you near me or my family. Please and thank you. Alright, what's good, Drew? You're 19 years old. Um, wow, okay. I mean, she knows what she's doing, but like, where's the bio? Where's the bio? I, I need I need some personality, like like uh personality question mark. Like, come on, man. 
Yeah! If you're under six foot, don't swipe right. Oh no, now I'm insecure! Fuck bitches, get money. I like that. A passion, ladies and gentlemen, a passion for Emily here. A passion. Do we need to go over the definition of Passion. Passion is a term used to denote strong and intractable or barely controllable emotion or inclination with respect to particular person or thing. Emily's passion is bar hopping. Come on. Come on, guys. Holy shit. Is she at freaking Hogwarts or something? You, you, can, you can shit on people even though it applies to you, right? Yeah, no, you totally can't, because I'll be like, dude, you suck at basketball. Now, I suck at basketball too, but, like, you're bad as well, you know, so we can be bad together. That's how I feel about this. It's, it's 2023, and nowadays we have to clarify that type of stuff. I, I appreciate that. I, I actually do. I appreciate the uh, clarification of your gender. It's 2023. Stay safe out there. <laughs> in her bio, she said, I make killer banana bread. But then she said, I've never made banana bread in my life. Either she's lying here or she's lying here. The conclusion made is that women are liars. She says, I play college lacrosse and I'm sort of funny. We all know women can't be funny. Yeah, fuck you, peasant. <laughs> Basketball, LGBTQ plus rights, pro choice, volleyball, met well, you know what? I was originally gonna tease her for this, but I think these two go hand in hand, so you know, that works. Am I gonna get cancelled for that? <laughs> the police, they are after me. To this person I said, I'm surprised. And then she said, at I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I don't remember what I was surprised at. So uh I'm gonna say that you identify as a female. I don't know who snitched, whether it's the girls I match on Tinder, or it was one of you fuckers, but yeah, my Tinder got banned. And uh, to be honest, I kind of deserve it. I don't know if you could label it as harassment or cyberbullying. Do I care that much? No, but still, it kind of sucks. You know, I like my Tinder trolling series that I post on this channel. So I feel like now's a good time to, you know, apologize. I'd like to apologize to anyone that's, that I've ever offended, right? If I've offended you and, and you took it personally and it really affected your day and, you know, I, I killed your ego, then I'd like to say that I'm sorry. I, I, I'd like to just say I'm sorry to the, the women gender in general. Everyone that's a woman, I'd like to apologize. Actually, not even just women because anyone can be anything nowadays, apparently. i just like to apologize to the world. I'm the worst. I'm the problem, as you can see. Even though you're going on the internet and you're subjecting yourself to anything that's on the internet and I happen to be someone on the internet i should be the one to change for you I i'd like to just say sorry and um no shut the fuck up